Oof. Okay, he or she. She. 18, early 20s. Cause of death? Well, I don't know yet. But look at this, stretch fractures on both wrists. The lab should run a chemical analysis and toxicity screens on the affluent in the refrigerator. So, where'd you go to dinner last night? We ended up staying in. Look at the contusion on her forehead. Yeah, it also looks like there's a puncture hole in her neck. So, uh, you guys just stayed, stayed in at your place and had dinner? <sighs> and we watched a movie. Mm -hmm. I need a printout of the levels of hydromorphone they find in her system. I can smell it. I don't smell any hydromorphone. Did he make a move on you? Oh, we're just friends, and I definitely smell hydromorphone. Just friends, yeah, right. That's not what he's thinking. I mean, I'm sure he's a nice guy, all right? I'm sure he's a nice guy, someone you can trust and talk to, go to the movies and all that crap. But I mean, sooner or later, he's gonna make a move on you, all right? Excuse me. There's no hydromorphone in her system. Can we just have the lab test for it? And what if he does like me, Eddie? What's wrong with that? What are you, jealous? I gave you a chance. I gave you chances, and you didn't want to do it. You were non-committal, so now suddenly you're interested in my dating life? Okay. No need to get testy. Can I use that? Thank you. We need to make sure that they find the overload point so that we can get an idea of what caused the fractures in her wrists and also also have them check the left ileum. There seems to be some degeneration on the edge. So did you guys kiss? 